In this video, you will learn proper soil collection techniques, how to prepare and submit your samples for analysis, and how you can get this soil testing done free. To begin the collection process, review the site and note any significant changes in the soil, such as color or texture. Take up to 10 to 15 composite subsamples from each area, depending on variations of your site. Be sure you are not taking samples from an area that has been recently treated with fertilizers or amendments. If organic matter is on the surface, be sure to scrape this away before taking your samples. It is vitally important to keep the sampling depth consistent. Erosion control projects should be sampled to a depth of 3 inches. Once you've collected your composite subsamples from each location across the site, combine them all together to get a cumulative 8-ounce sample. Take your 8-ounce sample and place inside a Ziploc bag, and then write the identification number on the bag with a Sharpie pen. Write the same identification number on another Ziploc bag and place the first bag inside. You need to fill out a registration form. Be sure to complete all information on the form. Also, make a copy for your records, and if possible, collect and ship the samples on the same day. Your sample will be shipped to an independent soils testing laboratory where full diagnostics will be run. Your results will be available within 72 hours from when your sample is received by the lab. For fastest results, be sure to overnight ship your samples to the correct address. To get a registration form, your identification number, and to take advantage of Profiles free soil tests, log into Profiles PS Cubes, then watch the PS Cubes software tutorial to learn what to do next.